So I did a video earlier uh, of how I kind of designed this, what I did and why. Uh, this is really all I'm burning right at the moment. It's just a bunch of scrap lumber. I cleaned out the loft in my garage and that's all that's really being burned in there right at the moment. Uh, I do have good wood that I'll be burning later, but um, that's where we're at. You can see the flames down in there. And uh, I've been burning for an hour and a half and it took about 45 minutes for the first boil. I was wondering if that pipe was going to be tall enough. It's, it's actually perfect. Um, there is no smoke at all uh, coming around the bottom of this pan. Um, I expected it to leak and it just does not appear to do that at all. In fact, I've even taken and uh, you can see the foam here in the ground. Some of that snow, but that is that white foam. So I've used that white foam. I use this uh, thing right here. <clears throat> it's exactly what this is designed for. I got this attractor supply. It's made by uh, Maple Traders. And it's designed to pull the white foamy stuff that you get on top of the water uh, for boil, ma boiling maple sap. If you've never boiled maple sap, it's uh, kind of the equivalent of the foam that you see on a raging river. That's what it looks like. So it's very clean right now because I just did it. So, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> excuse me. I got a cold. Sorry about that. Um, so uh, you can see it's starting to boil back up again. The boil is a little slow right now because I just stirred up the fire and added wood to it. Uh, so every time I do that, it actually slows down the boil a little bit because uh, it kind of blocks off. So um, let me open this up here. Show you what you got. So it's burning pretty good. But if you look, you can actually see that. Those flames are rolling right across the bottom of that pan, all the way back. Something about watching a fire is just, just mesmerizing, but you can see the little first brace back in there. We've got a little too much wood right at the moment for you to uh, be able to fully, fully see. Here, hold this a bigger. Let me see if I can get you. A little bit of a better view back in there for you folks. Let's move some of this on the side. Now you can see those flames are just going right against that pin all the way back in there. All the way back to the third brace you can see. So, I was able to show you all the way back. All the way back this far, a solid flame. Three quarters of the way back on that pan. And now that everything's going again, you can't even hardly see the... Don't do that, buddy. You can't even hardly see the uh, the pan. It's, it's just steaming so, so good, boiling so good right now. So... We have a successful project here. I'm happy. It's just it's just a steady, steady boil. It's not a screaming, rolling boil. But it's just a steady... Let's see if I can shut that so you can see it a little better. It's just a steady boil. But the whole pan, it's just boiling all the way across the whole pan like that. I guess I would have liked to have seen a bit of a hotter boil out of it, uh, more a, a bigger rolling boil, but uh, I am just burning scrap lumber right now. If I was burning real wood, I'm sure that that would be a lot different. And we're doing spring cleaning right now, so I'm not tending to this as much as I should be. Um, so anyway, that's where we're at right at the moment. Thanks for watching. We'll probably do another one.